in this video I'm going to talk about the shop products presentation element now to have a preview of the element go to shop uh, landing page classic or any of these two but I'm just going to choose the classic one so I'm gonna scroll to the bottom and as you can see here we have a strange looking uh, broken ish uh, element this is actually the um, shop presentation uh, uh, element and this element should display the products now uh, if you're probably like me in this situation that's because you just installed uh, Kalia Steam and imported the dummy data and this element feeds itself from WooCommerce and if you don't have WooCommerce this is how it's going to look like now um, in, even though you uh, install WooCommerce and install the uh, the dummy data still you will still have to edit this element so I'm just going to edit this page with a page builder and scroll to the element and I will access its options so uh, you can select here uh, how do you want to uh, have the layout for the element this is um, a tab layout meaning uh, there will be there, there will be a single row right here with uh, multiple products I'm just going to leave this like this and uh, at the end when I'm going to run this element properly I will get back and change to simple rows so now we have uh, we can choose whether we want to show the latest products for the moment I'm just going to leave it as yes you can add a custom latest products title the same goes for best selling products also you can change the title and the same for featured products now in case you don't know what featured means I mean for these two are quite obvious this is the latest what's latest and this is the best selling it's just a database query around but these featured products um, I'm going to show you also about them for the moment just get the, uh, this um, element running properly uh, so I'm going to select uh, all the categories actually for this, uh, this uh, element and the number of products to load now I will suggest you don't have to load too many because it will affect the performance of the page so I'm just going to say 8 and I'm going to save the element yeah so strangely nothing happens but I will publish and refresh the page I think that's what it needs yeah so something strange is happening I'm just going to pause and investigate yeah I'm very silly the thing is actually the element works for example if I click the latest products this carousel will show and uh, also will work for the um, let me just hit on the view page and if you're wondering okay but why doesn't it work for featured products well because there are no featured products yeah I missed that <laughs> so as you can see we have um, the latest products and best-selling products right here this is how it looks like and to uh, add some featured products I will go to the WooCommerce uh, to the backend first and to the products right here and if you can see here in this uh, 
list right here you have a star for each element I'm going to start these these three I'm just going to randomly click them just I just need five of them yeah and one more great so basically I have a few featured products if you want to change when you're into the product look onto the right you can edit here the this option whether you want it to be featured okay so back to the uh, shop right here I'm going to refresh the page and you will see the featured products should properly work so yeah like you like uh, uh, as you can see here it does work so we have for the latest and the best selling now I promised I will also talk about um, some options here first I said the featured so I just uh, explain what's the deal with them and we have this option right here the display style which you can change to simple rows now by rows it means that each uh, I'm just doing this because there's this uh, drawer right there uh, is more real estate in this uh, in this right here so as you can see uh, each each uh, part is in a single row the latest the best selling and the featured uh, products so this is the shop presentation uh, shop products presentation element it's uh, easy to use but like I said it depends on the uh, heavily on the WooCommerce uh, plugin so thanks for watching and see you in the next one.